So me and the brothers are going to Dallas, 19 hour road trip. And you're coming with me, Bismillah. Yeah, I'm sorry, that was the wrongest job I've ever done. Jumaat today, barely slept, but brothers restocked, mashallah. And oh man. Brother Yusuf with the John Maz. Of course. You guys want to be successful individuals, never leave off the salah, no matter where you are, no matter what you're doing. I think we got about 15 hours left on this journey. Yusuf, well, we got the space, man. Yeah, for real. We got the space, but we pay for the space in general. Are you doing Alhamdulillah. <laughs> Last time we spoke, I said there's 15 hours left. That was so, so inaccurate, bro. We have 13 hours left. We're in the middle of Tennessee. Alhamdulillah, the brothers are killing the drive right now, man. There's not much to show you guys because we're not really exploring, we're just driving by. But if we see anything scenic, then I'll definitely show you guys some clips of it. But until then, boys and girls, this is where we're at, guys. Sweet home, Tennessee. <laughs> ولا ينال العلا من طبعه الغضب ومن يكن عابد قوم لا يخالف One of the benefits of eating at a halal restaurant is that you can always ask the restaurant owners or the workers if you can pray there. And so if you're traveling, it's a life hack, bro. So keep that in mind next time. Shout out, shout out Bam Burger, bro. May Allah bless the staff there for allowing us to pray and increase their business and risk and sustenance. I mean. In Nashville, man. Bro, we're literally just chilling in the car and a brother pulls up right next to us playing Minshawi that loud, bro. What is it? What are the odds, bro? Well, I'm just thinking about like the, the chances of that happening to us. I want to show you all how many cars are on the street. And out of all these cars, the one car that pulls up next to us is playing Quran, bro. SubhanAllah. You guys hear it, man. The streets are filled right now because there was a concert and it just ended. And so, SubhanAllah, there's fitting on the streets, man. Wallahi, I feel like that was a sign. To fear Allah, have to follow Allah, even in situations where you have to witness so much fitna. One last stop. But this one's for Fajr, mandatory. The brothers, at this time of the day, man, half awake, SubhanAllah. We gotta fulfill the duties to the Lord. Bismillah. So he, there's three. Okay. Uh, separate Allah from divine action. Uh, oh. <laughs> Khalas, he's finished. Finally made it to Dallas, Texas, baby. I didn't record, but we got to go to the hotel, take showers, because I was feeling really, really dirty. Fez isn't over here, so we're about to just surprise him, inshallah. So I think the way we're going to try to surprise Fez is we're going to call him up, FaceTime him right outside of this house, because we have his location, we have his address. Inshallah, we're going to call him and say, hey, come outside. Change your plans, guys. Fez is at the gym right now. Getting a good workout, so I think we're gonna go catch him lacking up the gym. We'll try to surprise him over there, inshallah. All right, guys. Do you see him? Do you see him? Do you see him? Get out of here. What up, what up? Oh, bro, what in the world? Bro, I told you. No way y'all here, bro. There's that's Best prank of 2023. Dude, what the hell? <laughs> Yo, what's the moves, bro? <laughs> was it a good surprise? Best surprise ever. Bro, were you expecting it? Hell no. I thought you guys were coming like in a month or something. You you and Omar, bro, y'all be, be killing the surprises, bro. The thing about this message, the woman's side is open. Every time you walk in, bro, you just feel like, bro, I'll be, I'll be feeling mad nervous when I walk over here. <laughs> well, alhamdulillah, I think this is uh, Umar Suleiman's mansion. Fez just told me that he's a resident imam over here. <laughs> it's kind of reminding me of the DMV because the Shabab actually come to the DMV. You'll see some kids come to the masajid, bro, but over here, hey, look how many kids are over here. Just use everywhere. Popping out. Alhamdulillah. Oh! Oh, 
Uh, guys, we just hit the gym. Alhamdulillah. With the brothers, that's a move in itself, man. What's your favorite thing about Dallas, Texas? The culture, bro. What do you think about the Muslim community over here? The Muslim? Yeah. Yeah, I just joined. You just joined Islam? Yeah, right here. SubhanAllah, you're Muslim? Hey, hey. Yeah, but I, I, I gotta get started. This nah, bro. Allahumma barik. Give me a hug, bro. What's your name? Uh, DJ. DJ? Yes, sir. Allah bless you, bro. When did you accept Islam? Oh, uh, yesterday. Yeah, yeah, no crazy. way, bro. I was just walking. I was just trying to record a YouTube video, but what are the chances you run into another Muslim brother? Nah, it's crazy. I just joined yesterday, bro. What What inspired you to like join Islam? Just the teachings, bro. Just like what he was talking about, what he was teaching, like that. And I, I believe in the same. You know what I'm saying? I know it's a higher being, and you know, right now going to spiritual war for him. This video is straight full of like surprises, will lie, bro. What are the chances? I'm just having my phone out. And I'm just asking random people questions. And the first person I asked literally reverts to Islam yesterday, bro. We were literally doing it for geeks. We weren't even serious, bro. And we just said, yo, what's the Muslim community like this? And he's like, damn, bro, I just joined yesterday. Made it to Aisha Salah at the epic masjid. YQ. You have to call these masjid here in Dallas. Inshallah. Give you a little tour, man. Tour for myself, inshallah. <laughs> Twahid. Three. Twahid. Three. Separate Allah from divine action, all right? That's crazy. That's part two in this video. What's one thing you got to say about the like the Muslim community over here? Yo, I'm going to be honest. Like, like, I love it out here right now. Like, bro, the turnout was better than like, I could even imagine. Like, I've never seen a, this type of turnout at any mosque in Virginia. What do you mean? What do you mean by turnout, though? Bro, I've never seen this many rows in an Isha prayer. It's like a, on like on a Sunday, you know? Yeah. New day here in Dallas, Texas, man. It's my last day here. Right now, inshallah, we're gonna go see one of my favorite muftis, Mufti Wasim. <laughs> This is a 300 year old uh, piece, inner piece of the Kaaba yeah. cloth uh, from Sultan Murad's time. So, this was a piece of the Kaaba? Uh, the... I can't say definitively which part it was, but when they were doing renovations, that's when my teacher grabbed it. Oh, it's probably... oh okay. That's, that's, yeah. probably... that's how the old Karba looked like. That if is you look so over here, this is how the Ottoman Karba looked like up until 100 years ago. You guys can bring your hand here. Yeah. Well, I love that thing, bro. I think the over oh, it's so good, bro. Yeah. Cause it stays longer. Yeah, it's more natural. Like yeah. the longer this, this it's, that's alcohol food. based. This is like oil, right? Yeah, it's like what? What is it made from? It's like, central based oil. It's like the stuff like that's. Made from, like, <laughs> <laughs> no, let them know. Let them yeah, know, big no, shake. It is, uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> These are all the teachers that taught me in the final hadith here. So heavy jaza from all of them. Like this teacher taught me Bukhari, Muslim. Uh, Ibn Majah, Nasa'i, this teacher taught me Tirmidhi, Shamail, Muslim, Bukhari, this teacher taught me Tirmidhi, this teacher taught me Bukhari, this teacher taught me Abu Dawood, some Abu Dawood, this teacher taught me Tahawi. This is their teachers, their teachers, oh my God. all the way to Imam Bukhari, oh. to Makib ibn Ibrahim, to Yazid ibn Abi Urbayt, to Salma ibn Akwadi, and to the Prophet Sarah Wow. So this is like the, this, this is, is like the a chain. Feel a big shake. <laughs> See my man fans next time, man. We're gonna be there May 27th, May 29th. Inshallah, baby. We'll be there, inshallah. Inshallah, baby. I appreciate everything, bro.